Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einem neuen Tag von Hell of Pain DLC. Jetzt kämpfen wir gegen Daniel Bryan in einem Stahlkäfig. War der nicht noch gegen Randy Orton bei Hell in Cell ein, äh, ein Match? Komisch. Der hat doch Randy Orton zum Punking angesetzt, dann kam der World Strongest Slam und hat Mark Henry gewonnen. Und verteidigt. nicht. Entweder das kommt noch oder das kommt nicht mehr und dann habe ich das Spiel reingemacht. Bin ich aber irgendwie komisch. Naja. Als hätte der 2011 schon jetzt gemacht. So. Ich muss mal den Daniel fertig nehmen. Da war der ja verletzt ne, von der Fickshow. Bei Survivor Series. Ja, nee, dann. dann bei also, Survivor Series ist ja nach Hell und dann ist das Match nicht drin mit Randy Orton bei Hell in Cell. Nur das Night of Champion Match ist drin, aber das Hell in a Cell Match ist nicht drin. Schade. Ah, ist jetzt schlimm. Hat ja Marky Mark auch gewonnen und finde ich egal. Introducing first the challenger from Aberdeen, Washington. Aberdeen, Washington. Daniel Bryan says he knows over 100 submission maneuvers, and he, can, and he can apply some of them to Mark Henry's injured leg and ankle. Well, you're right. Daniel Bryan is a submission expert, and that's important tonight because inside a steel cage, submission is one of the only three ways you can win. The other being pinfall or escape. It's totally unfair that Mark Henry has to defend his championship tonight inside a steel cage on that bum leg. Of course, the leg injured by Big Show is a result of an attack at Survivor Series. Wait a minute, Cole, are you serious? Why, why is that unfair? Mark Henry is forced yeah, into this cool. match by SmackDown General Manager Theodore Long. He's clearly in no shape to compete here tonight. Long is just a boot. Well, I don't feel sorry for Henry at all. He's got him up. Oh, that scoop slam. Oh, and he lands that one right to the head. Earlier tonight, Kay, we saw a thrilling... Christmas 20-man battle royal with one of the most shocking conclusions I ever remember seeing. Yeah, who would have thought that Santa Claus would be at Raw, but we saw Darren Young in there, we saw Kofi Kingston, we saw Heath Slater, but in the end, it was Hornswoggle of all people walking away with the win. And after the match, the victorious Hornswoggle asked Mick Foley. Uh, 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 yeah. Oh, no! Falling down from the stratosphere. Well, Daniel Bryan cannot get cornered inside that cage. If he does, Mark Henry will pick it. Oh my gosh, you gotta wonder, can Daniel Bryan even get up after this beating? I heard a lot of talk in the locker room area earlier today that many doctors wouldn't have cleared Mark Henry for action here tonight. I don't know who you're talking to, Cole. What are you doing back in the locker room anyway? The bottom line is that Mark Henry passed a thorough exam and actually looks to be moving quite well right now. By the way, athletes like, like myself are allowed in the locker room. And keep in mind that it was Theodore Long's hand-picked doctor that cleared Henry tonight. I find that a little suspicious. Daniel Bryan earned this opportunity at the World Heavyweight Championship by yeah, Randy Orton, Wade Barrett, and Cody Rhodes. Wade Barrett and Cody Rhodes. Look at Mark Henry now. Oh, and Daniel Bryan. 
Ich gehe zur anderen Ecke und er klettert da hoch, lol. That's what I do. Secret blind by pinfall, okay. Also wie schnell? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Und dann Cash Daniel Bryan ein. Und er hat den Titel müssen wir sehen, wenn ihr Und dann ja, holt Seamus den Titel. Und dann gewinnt Big Show den Titel. Und dann wieder Seamus. Und dann wieder Big Show. Und dann Alberto Del Rio. Und so geht halt immer weiter. Ne? Und dann wird er eingestellt und dann gewinnt einer den Titel, der nicht da ist. The following contest is a handicap match. A virtual ring person. From Sills Beat, Texas, weighing 418 pounds, the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. This man, Mark Henry, delivered quite a beating to Ryback just a few weeks ago on SmackDown. Yeah, but let's not forget that the damage Mark Henry did came after the Shield interfered. It's not like Henry didn't have some help. We're just 13 nights away from WrestleMania where this man, Mark Henry, will square off against Ryback. And you have to wonder how wise it is for Mark Henry to climb into the ring with two competitors so close to such a big match. Well, we've seen Ryback take action to start to watch Mark Henry simply letting Ryback know that he too can beat two men. seeing Mark Henry and Ryback, two of the strongest men in WWE today, locking horns in two weeks at WrestleMania. And remember, Ryback was flattened by three World's Strongest Slams just a few weeks ago. And if Mark Henry can do that at WrestleMania, he will undoubtedly be walking away with the win. Mark Henry clearly sending a statement to Ryback here. Sending a statement? Yes. But can Mark Henry do it again when he squares off against Ryback at WrestleMania? That remains to be seen, King. One thing's for certain, though. Mark Henry will not stop until he inducts Jay Uso into the Hall of Pain. Oh, boy. That's it. He's out. There's a great video tribute to Mark Henry right now on WWE.com. It goes back in time to feature many of Henry's feats of strength over the years. And one of them includes you, King. Yeah, I remember. I was the unfortunate victim of Mark Henry the first time he ever stepped foot in a WWE ring. 
From that moment on, I knew Mark Henry was going to be something special. And if you go to WWE.com right now, you can see Mark Henry press slamming the king over his head and tossing him clear across the ring. And it won't hurt my feelings if you don't watch it. Oh, these guys clearly have a bright future, but it's not looking so good for them right now, Cole. Mark Henry appears bent on destroying the Usos. Yeah, see, the and you'd have to think that Ryback is watching with a close eye. I can only imagine what he's thinking while watching this destruction. This is not the first time Mark Henry has taken on the Usos in two-on-one handicap action. Oh, no, it's not. The Usos and Mark Henry actually That's traded victories man. back in November 2010 on WWE Superstars. But the Mark Henry of 2013 is a complete... And the Usos, they tried their best, but Mark Henry victorious again. Here is your winner, the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. Well, we've said it before, and once again, Mark Henry proves to be unstoppable. Who is going to be able to, you know, we might as well not even say stop. Who is going to be able to slow down the world's strongest man? I don't know. Mark Henry has flattened everyone in his path. Well, maybe Ryback can be the one to stop Mark Henry. I don't think Henry's oh, wait a minute. through the assault on the Usos. Mark Henry maybe looking to add two more people into the hall. Hall of Pain. How much more? How much more are you willing to pay to win this match? This is unreal. That's it. He's done. He's measuring. He's oh, his body has to be broken right now. Look out! What a move! And now it is show off what time. Do. Don't waste time floating here. Mark Henry has done it. I don't know about you, but I'm looking forward to these two behemoths, Mark Henry and Ryback, probably the two strongest men in the WWE today, locking horns in two weeks at WrestleMania. And you know, at this point in his career, King, Mark Henry may very well be the most dangerous man in all of WWE right now. Ryback, beware. Is this high stone?